Here is a common issue of when you're extruding a set of faces and you want them to maintain the same distance when you extrude them out. And what happens in Maya, they tend to scale out from the point of origin. So let me show you what that looks like. So here I have a bottom of a, uh, a rolling chair, like a computer chair, and I need to extrude the set of faces around it so they all go out at the same time from the cylinder, from my set of faces, and I want them to maintain the same direction as well as the same thickness towards the end. So a common issue is if you select the faces that you want to extrude for each of these. So when you press Ctrl E to extrude and you add thickness, you can see that it just begins to taper out or expand out. And that's not what I want. Now, you, if you do local translate Z, same thing happens. So how do you fix this without having to scale them uh, individually after you're done? So what you can do is you, you can use scale after you've extruded and then bring them in all at the same time by changing the axis orientation. So let me go ahead and I'm going to apply thickness and I'm going to do what I don't want it to do, but I need that thickness right now. I need it to be extruded. So once you've extruded out, the next step would be is to switch over to scale tool R and then double click on the scale tool to open up the options. And you want to change axis orientation from object to component. So this way you can deal with each component of the selected faces one at a time as by itself. So then now if I begin to scale, you can see them all of these are being scaled at the same time based on the component selection rather than the object of the world. If I go back to the default, which was object, you can see that if I try to scale, that's not going to work. If you try to change to world, same thing will happen. By changing it to component, you're now able to scale a set of faces and you're kind of treating each of these selections by themselves individually. So that's how you treat the problem of scale on your set of faces in Maya when you get the result that you just saw and how to fix it by using scale tool and changing axis orientation to component.